And how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So calculator is not allowed in this problem. If we have 81 to the power of 5 minus 81 to the power of 4 and we will just write this into the simplified form without using the calculator. So it means that we will show all of the working on this paper. So here the very first thing we are going to do is first we need to focus on the exponent of this term and the exponent of this term is 5. So we rewrite this 5 as 4 plus 1 minus this is 81 to the power of 4. And now here we will apply this nice exponent law. If you have a to the power of m plus n, it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n. So according to this exponent law, we uh, need to break this exponent and it will be written as 81 to the power of 4 multiplied by 81 to the power of 1 minus. This is our 81 to the power of 4. Uh, and now here further in the next step, uh, we need to take common 81 to the power of 4 and, and when you take common 81 to the power of 4, we get the remaining values are 81 minus 1. So you see here 81 minus 1 equals to 81 to the power of 4 and it is multiplied by 80. Uh, so here in the next step, we need to uh, rewrite uh, this uh, 81 to the power of 4 as we break this exponent and we write it as 81 square and its whole square and it is multiplied by 80. So uh, here first uh, we need to uh, uh, simplify 81 square and its whole square. So for this uh, we will first break 81 as 80 plus 1 whole square and its whole square and it is multiplied by 80. And now here in the next step we need to apply here uh, the nice algebraic formula. You know that uh, if you have a plus b whole square it is equals to a square plus 2 times of a b plus b square. So according to this nice formula we will write uh, or we will expand this uh, base square formula as uh, first you have 80 plus 1 square and here our a is 80 we write it as 80 square plus 2 times of a is 80 and b is 1 plus b square b is 1 square and its whole square and it is multiplied by 80. So now here in order to uh, find the square of 80 first you can just take the square of 8 we know that the square root of square of 8 equals to 84 and uh, the square of 0 here means that you just uh, doubled these zeros so here you have this is 1 0 we write here 2 zeros plus this is here we multiply 2 with uh, 80 so you get here 2 zeros are 0 and 2 8s are 16 we get here 160 plus this one square equals to 1 and its whole square and it is multiplied by 80. So further in the next step uh, here we have uh, we need to sum up all of these values so you add 0 plus 0 plus 1 equals to 1 this 0 plus 6 equals to 6 this 4 plus 1 equals to 5 and this is over 6 so you get here uh, 6 5 and 6 1 and its whole square it is multiplied by 80. So here further we need to uh, uh, expand the square of this bigger value so here I can give you a nice trick in which you can easily uh, expand this square sign so first we multiply this this number with this number and thus the meaning of square is that 65 61 is multiplied by 6561 and it is also multiplied by 80. So here first we need to multiply these two terms so here we have first we write this term as 6561 we rewrite this term as 6000 plus 500 plus 60 and plus 1 and at the last we multiply it with 80. So now in the next step we multiply 6561 each of these values and it will be written as 6561 multiplied by 6000 plus 
6561 multiplied by 500 plus uh, 6561 multiplied by 60 and uh, plus here we multiply 6561 with 1 you get uh, this number as well at the last we multiply it with 80 okay uh, so now here in the next step uh, we need to do these calculations and you see here we do these calculations in our mind so here we consider this is one digit number this is our four digit numbers so when you multiply zero with this complete number you get here zero when you multiply zero with this number you again get zero when you multiply this zero with this number you get zero now here we need to multiply the six with this number so you see here six ones are six and six sixes are 36 we write six and carry three six fives are 30 30 plus 3 33 we write three and carry three six six are 36 36 plus 3 becomes 39 and plus we need to multiply these numbers here you again consider this is one digit number this is three digit number so we multiply this zero with this number you get zero this zero with this number you get zero and now we multiply five with this number you get five ones are five five six are thirty we write zero and carry three five fives are twenty five twenty five plus three is twenty eight uh, we write eight and carry two five six are thirty thirty plus two becomes here thirty two and plus here we multiply this complete number with these two digits first so when you multiply zero with this number you get zero and when you multiply 6 with this number you get here uh, 6 ones are 6 uh, 6 6 are 36 we write 6 and carry 3 6 5 are 30 30 plus 3 33 we write 3 and carry 3 6 6 are 36 36 plus 3 becomes 39 uh, and here we have this is uh, right it's same as it is 6 5 6 1 and it is multiply with 80 and now here in the next step we need to uh, sum up all of these values so here you have this 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 1 equals to 1 this 0 plus 0 plus 6 equals to 6 6 plus 6 becomes 36 we write 6 and carry 3 this 0 plus 5 is 5 5 plus 6 is 11 11 plus 5 becomes here uh, 16 16 plus 3 equals to 19 uh, sorry here we have a little mistake when you add this 0 plus 0 is 0 0 plus 6 is 6 6 plus 6 becomes 12 so uh, we write here 2 and carry 1 uh, so we have this 0 plus 5 is 5 5 plus 6 becomes 11 11 plus 5 is 16 16 plus 1 is 17 we write 7 and carry 1 so this 6 plus 0 is 6, 6 plus 3 becomes 9, 9 plus 6 becomes 15, 15 plus 1 becomes 16, we write 6 and carry 1. So this 6 plus 8 becomes 14, 14 plus 9 becomes 23, 23 plus 1 is 24, we write 4 and carry 2. Uh, so we have this 3 plus 2 is 5, 5 plus 3 is 8, 8 plus 2 is 10, we write 0 and carry 1. So this 9 plus 3 is 12, 12 plus 1 uh, is 13, we write 3 and carry 1, so this 3 plus 1 becomes 4. So this is our 4, 3, 0, 4, 6, 7, 2, 1 and now we multiply with 80. So uh, now here in the next step we multiply this complete number with 80, we consider this is our one digit number and these are two digit numbers. Uh, so when you multiply this 0 with this number you get here 0 and now we multiply 8 with this number you get 8 1s are 8 8 2s are 16 uh, we write 6 and carry 1 so 8 7s are 56 56 plus 1 is 57 uh, we write 7 and carry 5 so 8 6 are 48 48 plus 5 becomes 53 we write 3 and carry 5 so 4 8s are 32 32 plus 5 is 37 we write 7 and carry 3 8 0 the 0 0 plus 3 is 3 8 3s are 24 we write 4 and carry 2 8 4s are 32 32 plus 2 becomes 34 
so this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos